Arizona is home to 22 indigenous tribes. Arizona State University's campuses are situated on the homelands of many tribal nations. In particular, the Aatong and Pipash, and acknowledge the many indigenous communities who reside in this territory. Skigik is the Aatong word that is now known as Phoenix, which was settled in 1881 by occupiers. The ancestors of the Aatham, the Huhugam, created canals and utilized surrounding rivers that are the basis of the current irrigation system that feeds Skihigik today. These waterways have always been the foundation and livelihood of the residents within the valley. Throughout the past 500 years, the impact of colonialism have been detrimental to indigenous lands and languages, affecting their livelihood. Many people who live in the Southwest are unaware of this history. Furthermore, ASU's indigenous student community consists of over 3,000 strong, not including faculty, staff, and alumni, who continue to thrive, educate, and advocate for the strengthening of indigenous ways of life. As the Autumn call it, Himdak, the way of life for the Autumn, encompassing their culture, traditions, identity, and being. As Autumn and indigenous peoples, our identity is tied to the land. Like our own bodies, we must respect and care for it, and we urge everyone to do the same. We challenge you to educate yourself about the history and the communities who continue to thrive today. Moving forward, it is vital to honor and respect that you are always on Indigenous land. Welcome to Spring 2021 University Commencement and College Virtual Ceremonies for Arizona State University. We welcome our graduates, families, and guests as we celebrate the Class of 2021. The placing of the University Mace by Professor Seamine Levinson, President of the ASU Faculty Senate, signals the beginning of this official University Ceremony. It is my pleasure to introduce the 16th president of Arizona State University, Michael M. Crow. Well, hard to believe, but here we are, commencement 2021. The exciting thing is that we're all here together in one form or another. We're very excited about being able to bring you the university graduation. In this format, we've got uh, 19,000 or so total graduating with us, but all of you also have the opportunity to be at your college or school uh, convocation. So we're very excited. That'll be more hybrid, uh, more, more personal, and more interactive. But nonetheless, here we are. Uh, we're in the middle of the global pandemic. Uh, we're in the middle of uh, rapid complexity, complexification of uh, all things. And yet, here we are. You've persevered. Your families have persevered. Uh, you've stuck with uh, all of the things now for more than a year. And I just want to say on behalf of the university faculty, students, staff, everybody that's a part of our community, congratulations to, uh, to all of you. It really is an unusual moment. It's one in which uh, we always, uh, uh, in, when we're together in a crowd, we uh, turn to our graduates and we ask them to uh, thank their families. So I hope that each of you will do that. Uh, uh, give them a hug, give them a kiss, tell them thank you, thank you for being there, thank you for supporting me, thank you for helping me through everything, thank you for helping me to understand that I needed to keep going and keep moving, <clears throat> and just thank you for uh, everything to get me here. We also ask that uh, all the teachers in our audience uh, stand and be recognized, the K-12 teachers, the community college uh, faculty, and we ask that our graduates thank uh, them, and as we thank and honor these teachers, that have brought you as graduates to us. We realize that we're a part of the process. We realize that we're a part of a continuum of learning, something that we call the universal learner co continuum. You go through your entire life. We believe that there's whole new ways to link learning together, so we just like to recognize all of the, all of the teachers. And then, and then there's our faculty. ASU has over 5,000 faculty members. Uh, this is a world-class research university. We've been involved in recreating how we teach, re recreating our learning environments, recreating and expanding and evolving our discovery and creativity environments. And so we found a way to construct a, a, a new kind of university, something we call a new American university. Our faculty are deeply committed to student success. Our faculty are deeply committed to community success. Our faculty are deeply committed to unbelievable demographic diversity in the student body. Uh, we work towards this. We, we've, 
We've greatly accelerated our graduation rates, the success of our students, the moving forward of our students. And so if we were together, I'd ask all of you to, to, to rise on our faculty so that our students that are graduating could recognize you. But I just want to take a special moment for the faculty that are watching this video to say just thank you. Uh, you've been unbelievably adaptive. You've been unbelievably creative. You have persevered. You have adapted to everything. And so, you know, we get, we get some rocks thrown at us, you know, uh, how are you doing and, you know, why are we doing this and why are we looking at everything on, on Zoom technologies and it's not as good as being physically present and so forth and so on. And so it often isn't, but it often is and in some cases is even better. And so what we found in this year uh, uh, of 2020 and 2021, what we found is that we've learned, we've learned to be a better university, our faculty have advanced, we've developed new t teaching and learning techniques, and given where we are and everything that we've been through, um, you know, I just want to say thank you to the faculty for all that you've been able to achieve, and I hope that each of you as students will reach out to the faculty that impacted you the most, to the faculty that had the deepest uh, uh, transformational effect on you, or the faculty member that really just got you going when you were down, and just say thank you. Just reach out, just say thank you, because it really has been a, a difficult year for everyone. You know, this, this year, I hope uh, people have seen what we have done. You know, we've, we've kept the institution moving forward in the middle of the first global pandemic in over 100 years. Uh, we have done that in a moment in time where the greatest scientific progress in vaccine technology that humans have ever been able to uh, bring forward has been brought forth during this year. Now we're struggling to you know, make sure that we get it out to everyone, but nonetheless, the science has been uh, unbelievable. We found ways to use technology to stay connected, to keep everything moving. We found ways to be, to be generous with each other, to be generous with those that uh, lost their jobs, to, uh, to uh, help uh, businesses to stay open, to help families to stay intact. Uh, we at the university have done all that we could, uh, and we can always do more if you're aware of other people that have needs to help people to be able to graduate, to help them financially, to help them emotionally, to help them in every possible way. And so I just want to say that, you know, this has been a moment, I hope, of, galvaniz of galvanizing you, galvanizing your thinking, and uh, uh, realizing that you should take nothing for granted, nothing. Uh, the world is uh, uh, as we uh, make it, and the world is as we adapt to it. And so uh, I know different people have reacted to everything in different ways, and we should be respectful of all of those reactions. We should recognize that some have been anxious and some have not been anxious, and we should recognize that, that uh, what we really need to do here more than any other thing, and this is what I'm so proud of uh, relative to ASU, is coming together, working together. We have a thing at ASU that we call the community of care, and 99% of the people involved with the university, our students, our staff, our contractors, our faculty, everybody, have taken on a burden of caring about other people as much or more than you care about yourself. And then that means we've been able to manage our way through this pandemic uh, in, in very effective ways. I think uh, the class of 2021, and I say this to people all the time and they don't really believe me, I think our models about students and uh, the preparation of students, I mean, students are not on a learning curve where we're giving them an education and someday they may do something. Far from it. You know, we're living in a world now where everyone is empowered by technology, they're empowered by the internet, they're able to study across cultures, they're able to study across uh, complex subjects, they're able to double major and triple major, they're able to do things, build things. I mean, we had a group of students this year uh, that uh, won the uh, X Prize for masking technology against a thousand other teams. We had a group of students this year, including online students who uh, have been involved in the design and deployment of a mission that will go on the surface of the moon. That's a scientific experiment. Uh, we've got unbelievable talent and, uh, and energy in our student body. And it's not something like we're just working to prepare you. We're just working to help you to be able to get a job. I mean, far from it. That's not what we do. Our job is to empower you to be a master learner. Our job is to take you coming to us from whatever uh, background you come from, whatever family background you come from, whatever cultural background that you come from, and empower you to be a master learner to be capable of learning anything, adjusting to anything, teaming across different subjects, taking on complex issues of social change, complex issues of economic development and economic progress, taking on global climate change, taking on sustainability, taking on the development of new kinds of businesses, new kinds of musical enterprises, new kinds of artistic expression. What we're after is a way in which we are set to enable and empower you. And so I've been very, very uh, excited about watching that happen across all the dimensions of the university, our public service academy and the Watts College uh, for Public Service and Community Solutions, our undergraduate student body, our graduate students, I mean, they are problem solvers now. They are teachers and learners and discoverers now. 
Uh, we've got students involved in everything imaginable, and, and from my perspective, it's just, it's just fantastic. Uh, uh, if anything, the pandemic has driven up our commitment to um, social equity. It's driven up our commitment to uh, having a deep impact across our society. It's driven up the creativity of our faculty and our students, and for all of that, I am grateful. But in particular to you, you all have passed through a particular uni unique moment. You may not see it now. You may still be grumbling a bit about, you know, that you, you, you know, you're not at a all university graduation and you haven't been able to see some of your friends and there have been, you know, obviously families that have, had, have suffered tremendous losses and all these things, but you are here and you are here with us now and you are prepared as well as anyone that's ever been prepared in the history of our species to now move forward as a 21st century learner, as a 21st century creator, solving all these issues that we're facing, all these complexities that we're facing, and, and there's a number of them, and so I'm very confident that this is going to be something that you're going to be able to do. Arizona State University is an institution that is deeply committed to the combination of egalitarian access, academic excellence, and deep impact on our community, and I hope that has left each of you with a a little personal addition to your, to your uh, mental DNA. And that means then that you understand what egalitarian access means in the functioning uh, evolution of a democracy going forward, that you understand that we have to drive up educational attainment, that you understand that we have to make certain that our institutions to advance our democracy are not exclusive. We can't be keep keeping people out of things. We can't keep be keeping people from graduating from high school. We can't be keeping people from voting. We can't be keeping people from moving on into careers. We can't be keeping people from not being able to go to college and move forward with their lives. We can't be keeping people who didn't or weren't able to finish college from coming back and easily finishing college. And so it's all about finding a way to help the democracy to work. So if I have a, a single message for you, it really is this. So you've lived through a unique time. You have advanced during this unique time. You have a unique responsibility. And um, there's nothing to be discouraged about. Nothing at all. There is, in fact, just the opposite. This is a moment of uh, a carpe diem moment, a seize the day moment. This is a moment for you to take your experience, to take what you've been through during this pandemic, what your family has been through during this pandemic, to take what our society has been through during this pandemic, if your family hasn't been particularly affected, to take what you've t learned here at ASU and move out and seize the day. Obviously, we need all kinds of great things moving forward. We have great opportunities moving forward, and I am totally 100% confident that the graduates of Arizona State University will leave marks going forward that will alter the trajectory for our country, alter the trajectory for our planet, and we'll all be better off because of you. So congratulations to the class of 2021 and carpe diem. Welcome graduates, family, friends. It is a remarkable day. It is a day of joy, of happiness, of accomplishment. And make no mistake that these feelings of joy and growth 
are mixed with loss and uncertainty that came from the past year. 12 years ago, I lost my beloved Aunt Susie to lung cancer on the same day that my niece, Billy Rose, was born. And so loss and new life was yoked together in my heart in a way that really made it impossible to parse out those feelings. And perhaps that sense of possibility in the midst of uncertainty and loss is what defines this particularly human moment in history for all of you. Now, poet Amanda Gorman expressed it this way, that even as we grieved, we grew. That even as we hurt, we hoped. That even as we tired, we tried. That we'll forever be tied together victorious. And so today is our victory, a shared commitment to learning, even when we didn't always know why or to what end or how, how we would possibly complete our work. But that commitment and all the people that have sacrificed to help you stay on your path, that is what we celebrate to get today, together. That is what binds us to one another. So here we are. You, your classmates, have persevered. You've arrived at this momentous occasion, the day forever that you have graduated from Arizona State University. I am so proud of all of you. There are so many exceptional students. All of you are exceptional, especially for this remarkable year. And in this field of excellence, I'd like to recognize two students in particular who have really made an indelible mark on the Herber Institute for Design and the Arts during their time here. First, I wanna recognize Amber Cook. Amber was born and raised on the Navajo Reservation in St. Michael's, Arizona. She was born with cerebral palsy. She uses a wheelchair. She has a slight speech impediment. Amber's parents raised her to be an advocate for herself, to be the independent person that she has become. Now, I got to know Amber in her role as president of the Herberger Institute Student Council. And I can tell you, Amber speaks out. She speaks up and she advocates tirelessly for her classmates. In an interview with ASU News, Amber was asked if she had any favorite spots on campus, and her answer will give you a sense of who she is. She said, I never really had any certain spot because I was always in motion. Today, Amber's graduating from ASU with a Bachelor of Arts degree in Art Studies and a minor in Design Studies, and her goal is to start an architectural firm that specializes in accommodations and suitable living and access for people with disabilities. And I have absolutely no out, no doubt that she will achieve in unbelievable ways. Second, I wanna recognize Omar Hashim. Omar came to ASU from Saudi Arabia. He grew up in a country where movie theaters were banned and he always hoped that there would be a time when that would start to change. And he wanted to be part of that change. He didn't give up his dream of becoming a filmmaker, even when his parents were against it. He didn't give up when di doctors diagnosed him with a rare disease in his lungs and told him that he would need a double lung transplant. He did not give up during chemotherapy for a post-transplant tumor. And he didn't give up when his body rejected those new lungs and he underwent surgery for a second time. Today, a year and a half after that second surgery, Omar is graduating with a Bachelor of Arts degree in film and media production. It's an amazing journey. Omar's perseverance, his dedication, have inspired his peers, his mentors, faculty, and I want to share with you what Professor Jason Scott wrote about Omar. In a world 
where we literally had to relearn how to breathe and how to share space with each other, Omar was a shining example of how to survive with grace, with humility, and with confidence. After graduation, Omar plans to continue his education as a graduate school at the Herberger Institute's Creative Enterprise and Cultural Leadership Program. Then, he plans to move to Los Angeles, work on films, and he intends to bring filmmaking and media entertainment to his home country and to other Arab markets where the film industry is still not strong. He's going to live and realize that dream that he had to be part of that change. Here's a lesson from Omar and from Amber. Creativity will rise like a river. It will find its outlet. It will shape the contours of life. All of you have that creativity inside of you. And now you have been trained at one of the best arts and design colleges in the world. You have honed your thinking, your craft, and your capacity capacity to communicate boldly and powerfully. Let this education be your superpower going forward to overcome and to thrive. And if you're ever in doubt about how to proceed, I'll ask you to consider what Amber Cook says that she learned during her time here, because it'll serve you well. I quote, pay attention, ask questions, seek help if needed, and build relationships. And to that advice, I would say, stay in touch. We will be here cheering for you all the way. Congratulations, graduates. We ask students, faculty, and staff to nominate those that have demonstrated outstanding qualities in the areas of excellence and innovation in creative practice, entrepreneurship, community engagement, outstanding design or arts educator, and research scholarship in design and the arts. Out of the 60 plus submissions that we received, the following nine students have been selected as finalists. In the category of excellence and innovation in creative practices. John Joe, Cross Institute. John is an artist and educator graduating with a Master of Fine Arts in Digital Technology, a degree program across the School of Arts, Media and Engineering, and the School of Art. His work aims to activate indigenous perspectives and dialogue about connecting to the land and place. His thesis exhibition, entitled Our Way, features technologically mediated documentation and a model sound walk on the ASU campus where members of the public can experience a version of John's own journey. Josephine Ortiz Merida, School of Art. Josephine is a Latina border artist born and raised in San Luis Rio, Colorado, Mexico. She is graduating with a Bachelor of Fine Arts in Intermedia with a focus on stop motion, animation, and special effects. As a creative mentor for the School of Art, she organized events and programs that help students create community. And she co-founded ASU Society for Art Video. In the category of outstanding entrepreneurship, Jennifer Madruga Chavez, School of Music, Dance, and Theater. Jennifer is graduating with a Master of Music in Performance with an emphasis in Opera. In addition to being a classical singer and a music educator, she started her own online business, Sing Pretty Designs, featuring music gifts with Jenny's unique opera designs. Xavier Noakes, School of Arts, Media, and Engineering. Xavier is graduating with a Master of Arts degree in Digital Culture. 
They led the Arts, Media, and Engineering Student Association and were also the lead tutor for the Digital Culture Tutor Center. Additionally, Xavier worked with the founders of a local arts company, Wonder Spaces, to initiate partnerships aimed at creating industry-relevant training for the school's grads, as they participated in ongoing NSF-funded program on the future of workplace wellness. Outstanding Community Engagement. Matthew Bilar Miranda, School of Art. Graduating with a Master of Arts degree in Art History, Matthew is a member of the inaugural cohort of the LACMA ASU Fellows. His work on the exhibition Undoing Time, Art and the Histories of Incarceration involved partnering with nu numerous community organizations outside of ASU, and he wrote significant content for two successful grant applications to the Art for Justice Fund for the exhibition. As a student, Matthew took leadership positions in two graduate organizations, the Council of Graduate Art Historians and Art Graduates, aiming to bridge the often siloed MA and MFA student cohorts. Oriana Gil Perez, the Design School. Oriana is graduating with a Master of Architecture, born and raised in Venezuela. Oriana has served as the president of the Latino Architecture Student Organization and is a member of the National Organization of Minority Architects. She is one of the founders of ASU's Design for Justice Initiative, a student-led initiative to decolonize design education. Outstanding Design or Arts Educator. Francisco Garcia from the School of Art. Francisco is graduating with a Bachelor of Fine Arts with an emphasis on painting. He grew up in Los Angeles attending a low-income school and witnessing gang violence. Graffiti was both an escape and an introduction to painting. In his words, later I became acquainted with nonprofit programs and mentors, and then I became a mentor. He serves on the National Council of Young Leaders. Outstanding research or scholarship in design and the arts. Deandra Lawson, School of Art. Deandra is graduating with a Master of Arts degree in art history as part of the first cohort of LACMA ASU Fellows. Deandra works as a curatorial assistant in photography at the Los Angeles County Museum of Art. In 2024, LACMA will present an exhibition that's based on her master thesis, which is a global consideration of artistic innovation by black artists in the 21st century. And Lisa Drew, School of Music, Dance, and Theater. Lisa is graduating with a Master of Fine Arts in Dance. For her applied project, she conducted a year-long interdisciplinary research project in dance wellness, exercise science, group fitness, occupational therapy, and psychology. Congratulations to all of our outstanding graduating students. The Alumni Association has presented the Moore Award since 1901 to those graduates with a 4.0 GPA who have completed their coursework towards their degree while attending ASU for eight consecutive semesters. This semester, we have 40 students who are receiving this award. Congratulations to these students on their accomplishments. The school directors have messages that they would like to share with you. And after each school director's message, we'll display the names of the graduates for that school. You can view individual personalized slides for bachelor's, master's, and doctoral degree recipients on the Herberger Institute Ceremony website. Hello, School of Art graduates. On behalf of all the faculty and staff in the School of Art, congratulations to you on your graduation day. 
You did it. You made it across the finish line and we know it wasn't easy. It is never easy. This semester in particular has not been easy. It's been more challenging than any of us had expected. Your creativity, adaptability, and persistence have served you well in this time of unprecedented change in the world. In this past semester, all of you have made art or studied art in new and unexpected ways. You've perfected your expression and have discovered new means of doing so. You've worked with alternative tools and materials. You've engaged with your peers, professors, and learning communities remotely, and your work has been exhibited virtually. And still, above all else, you made your art, you studied it, and you've shared it with us, your community, your family, and your friends. Congratulations. This is what it means to be in the arts. You make your art and you share your insights however you can. As you move into post-graduation life, please keep doing this. Please keep making your art. We need you to make your art in spite of any challenges that come your way now or in the future. And society needs you to make your art. As a society, we need the arts more than ever right now for wellness, for problem solving, for sparking our imaginations and for inspiring us when times are tough. So again, please keep making your art. And again, congratulations from all of us to all of you and warmest wishes for continued success and the very brightest days ahead. Ariana Belen Enriquez Chen Shi Jiang Diandra Lawson Matthew Villar Miranda Celia Young Lauren Alexandra Copley Miguel Angel Godoy John Joe Min Q Kim Emmy Hannah Paulina Mackinnon Julia Christine Martin Brandy June Reed Mary Christine Williams Bolun Ju Gay Lynn Addison Brian Alvarez Leanne Anderson Mirabella Sum Andrini Megan Marie Barbera Annie Opal Barnett Taylor Page Barris Chanel N. Beauchamp Lillian Felicity Beeson Alexandria Bellissimo Christopher Andre Bishop Caitlin Botero Sidney K. Bure Julie Bundesen Kurt Raphael Boriag Zorishadai Calixtro Garcia Ariana Cardoso Hans Dirk Shannon Drew Chatfield Hiram J. Chan Naomi Rain Clausen Amber Rochelle Cook Charlotte D. Cornelison Ellie Rose Coop Lily L. Davenport Jake Christopher Dorito Michelle L. Decker Alexis Shea Finnerty Brandon Austin Fragua Carly Elizabeth Fritch Kira Marie Fry Morgan Brianne Gallatin Devin Alexis Galli Claudia Idalise Garcia Quinones Amanda Lenore Gillis Haley Elizabeth Goncalves Yasmin Alexia Gonzalez Rhea K. Greer Hannah Kazaya Joy Henry Madison Ann Henson Ashley Holmes Melissa Suzanne Huff Helen Power Huisinga Aubrey Tyler Jacobs 
Alexander Peter Jakubowski, Aaron Marie Johnson, Erica Marie Kaufman Haas, Maria Patrice Kelly, Jeanette Kelly, Carol Binford Kinsey, Melissa Corey, Cassandra Lynn Kowalkowski, Olivia Noel Kraft. Michelle Rose Lechner, Cindy Louie, Megan A. Lindahl, Margaret Victoria Magadan, Leandra Milo, Marissa J. Mandelfino, Madeline Page Mansberger, Angela Rose Masker, Jing Chun Miao. Tyler Nicole Miller, Mauro Montenegro, Samantha Renee Morales, Lorena Moreno Valencia, Heather M. Morse, Violet Mustofi, Haley Munsey, Kensington Grace Olson, Allison Margaret Olson. Marissa Panfili, Paulina Anna Pardo, Melanie Jean Patton, Louisa Pinero, Miles Edward Plant, Mikel Jolie Rash Premo, Sarah Mateo Rea, Remington Thomas Revel, Christopher Patrick Reed. Beth Ryland, Erica Turkley, Bethany Grace Robinson, Shiloh Ray Rodriguez, Ashley Beth Santos, Carrie Serafin, Emily Marie Genevieve Sarda, Oliver Quinn Sayers. Jessica Rose Schaefer, Stephanie Ann Schippel, Kesem Scher, Morgan Kendall Signa, Gina Marie Sleeper, Savannah Haley Sterling, Jenny Victoria Stewart Rogers, Zhao Yuan Marcus Tan. Shelby Annette Thomas, Julia Hope Tamtania, Samuel Armand Touchet, Lev B. Uchitel, Claire C. Vasquez, Samantha Vasquez, Elaine Villella, Samantha D. Vidi. Kendall Alexandra Walsh, Jesse Wilkes, Matthew John Winter, Selena Sky Austria Woodman, Lexia Bryn Wookie, Angela Work, Jenica Zan, Jengguang Dong. Bailey Lynn Anderson, Laura Ashton, Nicole Albury, Jessica Balaton Balanon, Angelina Soleil Beeler, Josie Ann Benwi, Marley Denise Bernal, Angelica Renee Blanco. Scott Andrew Brockish, Jennifer Alice Byer, Devin Renee Carrion, Daniela Alejandra Chavez Rodriguez, Ashley Jean Coates, Eric Dion Crum Jr., Yezi Dai, Eliana Abeni Danowski Underiner. Natasha M. Julius Dickinson.
Joseph Dominguez, Lauren Arlene Edmondson, Nicole Marie Elmore, Marina Facone, Ray Foliente, Francisco Enuf Garcia, Selena Garcia, Vincent Garcia, Madison Gibbons. Jenna Glue, Amanda Granland, Adrian Green, Frida Christina Guzman, Cameron Reese Harper, Rose Louise Hasha, Leilani Hot, Chen Yu He, Jasmine Herada. Madison Page Hood, Julia M. Howe, Rudolph Randozzo Jackson Jr., Lathenia Janae Johnson, Alana Nicole Jordan, Mackenzie D. Kessler, Macy Kravitz, Danielle Marie Lang, Maria Lapenta. Arcy No Lau, Lindsay N Law, Alexandria Lazat, Jacqueline Marquez, Bridget Ann McCarthy, Rhonda K McClelland, Sanban Men, Keelan R Miller, Jenna Elizabeth Moore. James Michael Morrison, Nicole Marcella Navarro, Karen Nazario Marinchel, Gray S. Olson, Josephine Ortiz Morita, Miguel Fernando Osuna, Kelsey Phillips, Andrea Pro. Dene Rose Ravago, Ryan J Redke, Mark A Reichenberger, Alex Jacob Reyes, Tara Lynn Rhodes, Mia M Rios, Nathaniel James Rivas Donato, Janine Rivers. Diana G. Rodriguez, Celeste A. Salcido, Kira Saley, Isabella Ann Salvatierra, Adam Michael Sanders, Rachel N. Sanford, Athene Michelle Shuck, Selena Andrea Scott, Shannon R. Scott. Lisa Olivia Serrano, Abriana Elizabeth Shadow, Bethany Shear, Aspen Morgan Showers, Aaron Signori, Paris Elizabeth Smith, Kylie Y Snyder, Jesse Lee Stephen Colucci. Itzel Shamara Sukolis, Yuan Hao Tang, Gavin J Toba, Christian David Valencia Hernandez, Emily Dill Vance, Maria Jose Varela, Lauren Rose Wadsworth, Varissa M Washington. Noah Christian Watts, Heather G Weller, Sijie Xiao, Shikendi Chantel Zakiri, Carson Mackenzie Zick. Hello, graduates of the School of Arts, Media, Engineering of the Spring 2021 cohort. Congratulations on your well-deserved success. I am Pawan Turaga, interim director of your school. 
and it is my honor and pleasure to be here with you today. I will also be present physically for your in-person graduation, so I hope to see some of you there. I wanted to shoot this video in the bright and sunny environments near my house as a sign and symbol of what may be coming. We are nearing the end of our struggles with the pandemic and I'm really looking forward to positive new beginnings and cheerful, brightful uh, futures for all of us. With that, thank you so much and congratulations once again. Derek Paul Drudge Dylan James Kerr Xavier McDonald Raymond Xavier Noakes James Darnell Williams II Amber Aguirre Albert Vang Megan Elise Baudet Shalandra Loravena Benali Skylar Bloom Karina Brocklow Colin Brown Jiaying Eliza Brust Christy Caldwell Paul Alexander Soralo Edward Paul Chavez Talia Danielle Chuk Christian Joseph Cuccinello Elizabeth Nelson Davis Amelia Lorraine Edwards Brian Yuan Fu Kevin R. Garcia Nako Garcia Danielle George Matthew Rafael Goldman Jocelyn Giselle Gonzalez Rowe Austin J. Hendricks Andrew Taylor Hershauer Patrick John Hoffman Bailey Rose Huff Jacob Aaron Janizek Mason Akira Kondo Michael Anthony Kotnick Max Christian Lewis Cindy Lee Santiago Lopez Amaro Jr. William Laurent Tony Ma Angelica Machuca Melanie Ann Morano Richard Ernest Marquez Laura Avani Moles Nija Wanye Joseph Morgan Kan T. Win Josh Ong Isabella G. Pando Anthony Joseph Pedroza Elise Honor Peterson Christian Puebla Gabriella Beth Rich Thomas Andrew Richardson Adrian Sanchez Anastasia Sanchez Jordan David Sandoval Anthony Mauricio Santos Mark William Scott Joshua H. Staples Eileen Villarreal Demos James Fotias Han Shun He Joshua James Liska Perla Yaretsmi Martinez Lugo Tyler Charles Shogger Happy Herberger Institute Convocation Day. I am Heather Landis, director of the ASU School of Music, Dance, and Theater, and it is my pleasure to congratulate and recognize all of our music, dance, and theater graduates. What an interesting and challenging end to your ASU academic career it has been due to the pandemic. And I want to recognize that it has not been easy for any of you, but you should be so proud of your accomplishments, your perseverance, your drive, and your resilience. And I do not just mean in the last year or in the years of your degree, but all the way back to when you first embraced the arts as your calling. And here you are and you did it and you should definitely celebrate. 
At their most fundamental level, music, dance, and theater are languages. They touch our emotions. They can lift our mood. They can make us feel more hopeful and more fulfilled. And as a music, dance, or theater artist, educator, clinical practitioner, or scholar, we have learned that we each have a unique voice. We each have something to say. And we each have ideas about how we will engage with our creativity and how we will engage with others creatively. Please use the lessons that you have learned in the ASU School of Music, Dance, and Theater, particularly in the last year, to continue to develop your own unique voice, your own distinct message, and your own mission for how you will use your art to make a difference in the lives of others, in the community in which you live, and to communicate creatively about what it means to be human with the hope that this uncertain time affords us more possibility for change and adventure than ever before. The ASU School of Music, Dance and Theater faculty and staff join me in congratulating you and celebrating all your accomplishments. Congratulations, graduates. Devin Thomas Arney. Spencer Paul Brand. Ashley T. Bush. Zachary Warren Bush. Jun Tai. Wenhui Chang. William Michael Clay. Cynthia Charlotte Dahlgren. Francisco Javier Dudley D'Alba. Elizabeth Jane Druzetto. Mohammed Ali Majid Farag. David Thomas Gonzalez. Brian Hernandez. Francisco Jose Hernandez Bolaños. Ega Kusuma. Aushuang Li. Julia L. Lockheed. Bruce John Mansfield. Andrew Marshall Quiring. Masaru Martes Sukuma Kalatiud. Kiernan Steiner. Tyler Wales. Yi Jiang Yun. Mallory Afton Alekna. Chang Chang Long. Danta Devin McGilvery. Nicola Olson. Alston Walter Schoen. Zachary Thomas Wiggins. Lee Ashley Ale. Madison Archer. Tabitha Ann Branson. Casey McCalman Cole. Eric Leonel Correno. Caitlin Noel Martinak. Lisa Pauline Drew. Blake Anthony Edwards. Tiffany Suzanne Fox. Michael Nicholas Herring Harmon. Jillian Michelle Johnson. Chin Zi Le. Erica Kristen Lindegren. Jenna Michelle Nilsson. David Michael Osmondson. Adrienne M. Raff Corwin. Jesse Daniel Saywell. Zichian Zhou. Trisha Ann Dahili Bacalso. Nathan Eldon Benitez. Amy Nicole Bergren. Lucas Henry Butterball. Sichang Chen. Ofer Joshua Cohen. Elise Francis Daniels. Samantha N. Davalos. Caleb Davis. Galadriel Anna DeMarco. Kelly Lee Duncan. Olivia Spears Fletcher. David Michael Gatchell. Laura Ashley Glom. Chian Hao. Chandra Harvey. Caitlin Renee Hawkins. 
Dahye Kim Yuka Kubota Stephen Anthony Kubelbeck Shi Lu Meng Shi Luo Jennifer Movita Madruga Chaz Quentin Martino Joel Adalid Martinez Lorenzana Joshua Asher Mayo Mason McDermid Teresa Murphy Jerry Michael Nanny Sonia Joanne Pritchico Paul Joseph Reed Michael Robinson Gabriel Robles Jasmine Rodriguez Ryan James Rubison Thomas Marion Sanders Lauren Teresa Scott Yu Yao Shangguan Yian Shen Charles Joseph Smith Julie Stafford Bruno Streck Rodriguez Dylan K. Suhiro Kashmira Wenwen Tata Darius Taylor Emily Page Telling Michaeli Todd Jacob Lake Verhine Esther Elaine Witherell Jamie Wu Chen Chen Zhang Mary Osset Andres Cassidy Grace Atkins Ashley N. Ochenkloss Zachary Joseph Baxke Carlos S. Becerra Andrew Robert Blahak, Jr. Elena Diane Conti Rachel Lee Cooper Brittany Lee Corral Samantha A. Duran Nicole Elizabeth Eckland Michael Girardi Brandon Vance Gray Kenneth Ryan Grisset Savannah Marie Gunton Argentina Guth Martin Alberto Herrera Sierra Page Holly Andrew R. Hobson Ian K. Irizari Adeline Medora Jacob Troy Shirk Jansen Shuang Jiang Jiang Sarah Elizabeth Johnson Sydney Renee Kerr Sophia Eve Kanasiak Taryn Landis Hunter James Langenhorst Rain Jasmine Locker Scott Richard Martinez Antoinette Dominique Martin Hansen John Frederick Maines Andrea Mendoza Rebecca Yolando Moreno Ashley Deborah Panic Kravitz Dewan Paul Porter Patrick John Rivers Nathaniel Romanette Sadie Autumn Schuffler Stephanie Ann Self Autumn Ray Sr. Williams Gina So Jolie Alexandra Strickland Valerie Grace Stutterheim Diego Benjamin Sutcliffe Seth Elijah Tutnick Isaac Vincent Wisdom Sierra Dor Woodward Victor Yang Chasen Evan Ziner Daniel J. Zameda 
Leah Rose Zweig. Ella Ryan Alzua. Carly Rose Alt. Liliana Maria Serda. Madeline Ivan Gikas. Mira Hills. A.J. F. Johnson. Zakia R. Johnson. Courtney Jules King. Amanda Monteith. Hannah Justine Murray. Avery Bryce Polster. Steve Iram Rosales. Diavian Nicole Samuels. Shannon K. Smith. Savannah George Thompson. Scott Ethan Allen. Vashon Michael Aurora. Madeline Ann Banks. Honor Nicole Barrett. Margaret Rose Berry. Liesel Bradshaw. Richard Joseph Brennan. Deanna Marie Burringrud. Anchi Tai. Alicia Castillo. Hannah Kelsey Christensen. Benjamin Andrew Cortez. Brooke Catherine Durboro. Kenneth Ronald Edmondson. Jacob Lewis Enerson. Martin Hans Eslava. Aidan Ricardo Flores III. Ryan Thomas Fowler. Matthew James Fox. Tyler Joseph Garcia. Edward Jesus Gill. Michaela Goicoechea. Justin Michael Hack. Ji Kun Huang. Liu Yi Jiang. Drew Johnson. Isabel L. Jalazade. Alexander Evan Kansos. Zachariah Kennard. Tanya Landau. Griffin Ellis LeBlanc. Gabriel Algazi Lehrer. Andy Lee. Yueze Liu. Mario Caesar Manzo. Dana O. McCarty. Brianna Marie McClure. Jalen Jarrell Montgomery. Robert A. Nelson. Kayla Renee Newberger. Raul Nino. Eliana J. O'Brien. Kaylee T. Otsuka. Victoria J. Padmos. Greta Perlmutter. Nicholas J. Rayer. Reese Taylor Roberts. Kathleen Shea Roden. Grace Annette Roman. Harmony Lynn Louise Salvas. Taylor Alexandra Sapanara. Bennett Brock Sarager. Hayden Shainer. Gwendolyn Grace Sierra. Joshua Simmons. Aaron Matthew Smith. Thomas Smith. Ashley M. Stull. Jordan Anthony Thrall. Madeline Wampler. Chen Wang. Xing Yu Wang. Mitchell John Weeks. Sophia Grace Wetzel. Hi everyone, Phil Horton here. I'm the interim director of the design school and I'm here to congratulate all of our amazing graduates uh, you've all done incredible work, especially during a, a very, very difficult time. A college education and completing a college education can be a huge challenge on, on any given year, 
but certainly in a year like this, uh, for you all to be completing your college education says a great, great deal about you. One thing that I think is important uh, to sort of share with you all is that uh, it's easy in a moment like this to think about how we've been affected by a lot of different difficult situations, uh, but it's a wholly different thing to think about how we've changed through it and particularly how we've grown. Growth isn't something that happens to us. It's something that we produce. Uh, I think many of you have grown uh, substantially through moments like this. That growth is going to propel you forward in a lot of great ways. Uh, you'll inevitably continue to grow as you move forward, and we can't wait to see how you'll grow, either through your professional careers or through uh, further studies or, or whatever you go on to do next. We hope you'll stay in touch. Our alumni are so important, and particularly to uh, reflect years later about how our alumni are doing having come out of a moment like this will be really important. Uh, we think that you're all gonna do amazing things. We're proud of you already. Thank you for all of your hard work and congratulations to you on your graduation. Matthew Lee Anderson. Ariel Baltazar Medina. Ladon Renee Bentley. Samuel Benhersha Bernadsha Thana Edison. Tejaswara Bardwaj. Roti Bhattacharya Raven Alexis Cannon Adrian Castro Martinez Jacob Clough Brian Noel Esparza Christopher Fernandez Oriana Itamar Gil Perez Aishwarya Gananeshwar Lester George Graham, Jr. Tiffany Hartano Alisa Giselle Hernandez Llamas Mark Hernandez Schilling Brittany M. Hester Smriti Jane Tyler David Kirpan Srinidhi Krishnan Akarsh Kushalapa Kupanda Chi Lun Li Insyon Li Douglas Allen Lusson Saber Lyman Atziri Yadira Madera Sabido Avinash Nitimbai Mangukya Anud A. Manch Nathan Ray McNeely Quentin Tai Chi Miller Spencer Wilson Mitchell Yanela Nunez Ventura Cynthia Nirinwaya Cole Austin O'Brien Shristi Ojha Krutiban Barak Kumar Patel Ele Paul Monique Paulus Ricky Pedragon Shasta R. Percival Kendall Nicole Place Travis Rosenlieb Yudit Minesh Shah Slade Gregory Schaefer Abdul Rahman Shoger Riley Sun Smith Charlotte Ann Taylor Vishaka Shantanu Tuljaprakar Anna Maria Utter Shreyank Vadel Yuan D. Wang Cody Wyatt Steve Yazzie Alyssa Augustine Ryan Colwick Shaoran Du Brittany Leanne Jean Yu Pang Zhao Ze Yu Li Yiki Luo Mary E. Palmer Kyle Matthew Takasi Xin Yu Wang Jia Li Yang Peng Ye Zhang 
Krista Lee D'Alessandro Rachel Marie Frail Jae Hwan Lee Danielle Smith Srujana Tarikanda Digeshwar Kumar Parsotambai Vasava Elizabeth Ferguson Kevin Michael Schofield Amanda Trakas Anusha Manjanath Bijal Robert Wesley Murray Alexander Gregory Davis Shelby Nicole Liu Angela Diane Tate Holly Brooke Carter Hui Chen Hitisha Daryani Jialu Gu Ajanta Angie Malik Michael Angelo Torres Dan Chi Zhang Ahmed Hadi A. Alawami Yusuf Abdulaziz S. Alsinan Catherine Emiko Aoki Brooke Kaylee Bine Rogelio Botello Sitong Tao Zyra Castillo Joyce Ruth Chon Evan Bradley Cohen Tan Tsui Lauren Nicole Da Fonseca Lynn Dang Alexander Ray Ellis Gabriel Thurkel Frank Yesenia Guadalupe Grajeda Perez Songlin Guo Mia Raquel Hargraves Lindsay Heck Nicholas Christian Herder Anissa Rochelle Jenning Nicholas Paul Kasparian John Allen Katoa Marcus Patrick Kelly Palmarin Sidney Kiernan Margaret Emmeline Crayling Kaylin Lilith Lamus Amy Guoran Lil Janelle Alyssa Lloyd Juan Lopez Diana M. Machowski Luca Tyson Christopher Marshall Zachary T. McGee Jasmine Miguel Nick A. Newberg Andres Olper Molly Padro Kendra Rose Pasco Tatiana Yvette Pexen Nigeri Khalil Randolph Pamela Sophia Rascon Lemus Princessita Scott Noah Smith V. Quang Tran Eliana Flores Van Dyke Leslie Maria Venser Baca Hauran Wang Yui Yamane Yunxian Yao Xin Yu Zhang Bronwyn A. Zieba Nick M. Abbott Griffin David Adams Elizabeth Marie Aguilar Muhammad Ali Alaidin Carly Joe Allen Mohammed Al Tahir Nika Jimenea Bacalzo Alyssa May Ronquillo Barron Erin Elizabeth Bascom Chase Grant Beezer Nicholas Joseph Becerra Yasmin Ben Abdelkader Shelby Ben Shalom Rigoberto Berber Arias
McKenna Chase Bonds, James Robert Boydell, Brooke Marie Burge, Alonso Vladimir Cabrera, Angel Esteban Caldera, Ashley Jade Cameron, Cesar D. Chavez, Mangwei Chen, Tristan Scott Chimak, Sierra Cisneros, Ian C. Klaus, Zelda Ann Cole, Brett Walker Carell, Alexis Marie Cortez, Amadeus Cruz Hernandez, Alexandra N. Chea, Tyree Rick Dalgai, Paloma Delgado, Luis Duarte, Alexander M. Dunbar, Tyson Stephen Irwin, Alan Estrada Sanchez, Nathan R. Everson, Talina Felix, Isabel Fernald, Kennedy Caprice Frazier, Chloe Gabriella Friedman, Christina Garibay, Dominique D. Gibbs, Catherine Ann Giuseppe, Connor Richard Glass, Regan L. Glover, Rafael Eduardo Gonzalez, Clara Hall, Alyssa Christine Hamilton, Emily Nicole Hammer, Tristan Colby Hanks, Andrew Michael Harvey, Catherine Anna Hawkins, Shintong He, Joshua Daniel Hernandez, Sarah Elizabeth Hickey, Jasmine Hidalgo, Hannah M. Hill, V. Ho, Jessica Ruth Hollock, Preston Noel Howell, Wei Shi Huang, Shu Han Huang, Mackenzie Humphrey, J. Wan Hyun, Matthew Louis Iacovelli, Biracia Jones, Jacob A. Jones, Kate Elizabeth Jocelyn, Nicholas Sebastian Calas Hernandez, Yasmin Natalia Catan, Taylor Ray Kelm, Hope Isabel Kiesling, Janelle Marie Kinsey, Tally Joe Klawicki, Alexandra Kowich, Colton D. Kuntz, Changhua Kyung, Melinda Ray Laudal, Mia Martina Ledesma Galindo, Jung Tae Lee, Daniel Gregorio Lovato, Jingran Lee, Ke Yue Lee, Xiao Chi Liu, Lauren Gabriella Lord, Han Yan Liu, Si Jie Ma, Ryan W. McKee, Laurie R. McQueen, Joshua Markham, Daniela Morentes, Calvin F. Marin, Jordan Marshall, Angela Nicole McChesney, Abigail Lee McCrady, Cheyenne McGrath, Olivia L. McKay, Halima Ahmed Mehram, Lindsay Ann Miles, 
Rita Momika, Susanna Marie Montgomery, Anissa Munoz, Scott Michael Murray, Hannah Elizabeth Nelson, Nicole Ann Nelson, Jang Jiamei Ning, Anna Valeska Nigren. Rachel Irene O'Boyle, Joshua J. O'Dwyer, Annika Marty Olenek, Giovanna Melissa Olivas, Juana M. Olmedo Zaragoza, Sutton O'Neill, Ashley Christine Padilla, Maria Elena Palma. Justin Dorothy Palmer, Solana Shea Pearson, Michaela E. Palayo, Ni Dang An Fan, Carolise A. Poole Fraser, J. M. Carlos Puget Jr., Jia He Chu, Sam Quintanilla. Ricky Margaret Reed, Sydney Alana Roach, Aaron N. Robinson, Diana Laura Rodriguez, Emily Jean Romero, Jake Allen Rosenberger, Kinich Ruiz, Mia Isabella Salazar. Dale Justin Saltwater, Jenna Isabel Sanchez, Alexis Santana, Alexandra Faye Shot, Jacob Evan Sobelman, Robert C Stein, Byrus Akef Swice, Caitlin A Tapaha Madsen. Savani Macaran Thegali, Annie Michelle Torgerson, Megan Marie Van Horn, Mina Ashley Vargas, Paula Lineth Vega Soto, Joshua C Verbeck, Kirsten Brianna Vermeulen, Marielle Vogliati. Clara Matilda Irene Wallengren, Chen Ran Wang, Wen Jing Wang, Misha Weibel, Cameron K Wick, Luna Lilo Young Wilcox Jr., Mackenzie Lucille Wilson, Ya Tong She. Yi Ming Xu, Taylor Nicole Young, Tian Ran Yu, Chao Yi Yuan, Sarah Perla Zagori, Ni Jian, Yi Lin Zhao, Marco Abasta. Nasser Bader N. Alatik, Evan Lamont Bowen, Stephen Castro Saravia, C. C. Chen, Natalie Arleta Clayshult, Gianna G. Conrado, Stella Zuja, Malik Gay, Madison Gidley. Spencer M. Heidish Jr., William John Jenkins, Yu Hang Liang, Nadir Lopez, Miguel Martinez, Marissa Gabrielle Main, Kendra Milhone, Valerie Ann Perkins, Colton Roach. Haley Page Smith, Eric Staggers, Jan Bin Wang, 
Cameron Wells. Junjie Wu. Zixin Yan. Hello, Fall 2020 graduates. I am Dr. Jason David Scott, Interim Director of the New American Film School and the Herberger Institute at Arizona State University. I just want to take a few minutes to tell you all congratulations. You all in particular have had your educational experience impacted by COVID in ways that none of us have. So many of you had developed these really great plans for your senior year and, and making amazing films, and you had to change those plans more than once. Uh, throughout this year, our faculty and our staff and your fellow students have been so inspired by the way that you have adjusted, innovated, and thrived and how much you've been taking care of yourselves, taking care of your work, and most importantly, taking care of each other. Even though this wasn't the senior year or the graduation any of us would have wanted for you, uh, we're no less excited about sending you off into the world to tell amazing stories and as proud as we can be about what you accomplished while you were here. You are the first graduating class of the New American Film School, a distinction that I hope you carry with honor for the rest of your lives. Congratulations, keep working hard, keep taking care, and keep in touch. Kate Ackley. Rita Albafro. Ryan Anderson. Chelsea Arianes. Natalie Ann Bacon. Andrew Philip Ballin. Autumn Rose Billy. Alora Danielle Blackburn. Austin W. Bogart. Andres Brower. Alana Lee Brent. Landon V. Byers. Amy Laura Cable. Tristan Club. Tyreek Cody. Caleb David Cruz, Jacob Allen Davidson, Vanessa de la Trinidad Ruiz, Carla Leticia de Leon, Adrian Murray Dennis, Derek Anthony DeSorbo, Kaylin Nicholas Abada, Sydney Marie Edwards, Michael Germain Fitzsimons, Kai Chi Fung, Riley Fraser, Brandon Charles Fuchs, Adam F. Gotch Davenport, Samuel Gherkin, Mai Zhang, Devin Gillis, Christopher Gonzalez, Andrew James Gooden, Emil A. Hackman, Alyssa K. Hans, Michael Colby Hassan, Omar Homam A. Hashem, Tage Matthew Helmstatter, Zachary James Hendricks, Ruth Hesh, Hugh Kevin. Dumawa Hornsby the Third, Serena Margaret Lillian Hoskins, Michael Bradley Kaufman Jr., Cameron Alexander Klein, Michael Thomas Landry, John Timothy Lazanke, Amber Marshall, Christian Enrique Martinez. Noriko Matsushita, Haley McCord, Garen Miller, Francisco J. Molina, Rogelio Manares, Samantha B. Morse, Catherine Newsom, Quinn Chi Win. Isabella Catherine Nilsson, Christina Ortiz, Coulter Ray Payton, 
Jacob Zoltan Pap, Jillian N. Powell, Genevieve Quenon, Tanner Lawrence Rhodes, Morgan Richardson, Kevin Valentin Rivera, Miguel Angel Rodriguez Jr., Stevie Rowe. Anthony Gianforte Sachi, Xavier Lee Sanchez, Dante Martino Sanelli, Luisa Fernanda Santos Martinez, Sedona Rose Salnier, Carson Davis Schilling, Vivian Naomi Serafin, Jaza Race Shake. Jasmine A. Shambo, Maggie Smozinski, Anna Spalding, Cameron Kathleen Dagoro Stanton, Zach Allen Stone, Shania Nashia Stirrup, Kendressa Sila, Trayvon Malik Thompson, Matthew Adam Tolson. Gail Denise Acosta Tomembang, Taryn Ray Tronis, Victor Isaiah Vasquez, Connor Watson, Justin Michael Wayne, Sebastian Gregory White, Cameron Ryan Whiteley, Isaiah Williams. Jalen Williams, Wid Isam Yareb, Lehen Rai Yazi, Ting Jun Ye, Enya Zadarain Castro, Abraham Ziger, Noe Badil, Fahad. A S M E Ben Salama, Kelly Bevan Butler, Amelia Maria Maholka, Jennifer Ann Lindquist, Elizabeth Odessa Deichman, Yu Xuan Li, Jia Hao Chan, Kristen Lee Carson. Jesus D. Lopez, Megan Maria Lopenin. And as we conclude the Herberger Institute for Design and the Arts convocation of May 2021, the graduating students have a few thoughts they'd like to share. I'd like to thank my family and friends and faculty for supporting me through college, and I'm glad to be moving on to the next part of my life. Thanks, Matthew. Thanks, everyone who helped me. Happy graduation! I'm so glad to have met so many friends at ASU, and I will miss you guys all. Thank you to my friends and family for this moment. I appreciate all the love and support you've given me, and I love you, Papa. This is for you. Thank you to my parents and the rest of my family members, my friends, my professors, and everyone who's helped me reach this point today. I'm so thankful for my time as a Sun Devil. Thank you to all of my friends and family who have supported me throughout the last four years. I wouldn't have made it this far without you. It's been a huge honor, and I'm really happy to graduate with everybody. Thank you, and I hope everyone has a blessed life. I just want to say thank you to everyone that has supported me through this, especially my mom and my dad. I also want to thank ASU for giving me this opportunity. Go Devils! Thank you to my parents for making my college career possible. If it wasn't for you guys, I wouldn't have achieved this milestone in life. I want to thank my mom, my dad, my brothers, and my family for supporting me throughout my whole college journey. I'd like to thank all my friends, family, coworkers, and of course, students 
who have supported me on my grad school journey. I'm all done now, and I'm gonna go take a nap. Thank you so much to my friends, my family, my amazing students, my wonderful teachers and professors and mentors, to my dad, and most of all, to my fiance, Sean. Just wanted to thank my family, my friends, and everybody at ASU that's helped me out through the years, and uh, professors as well. I'm so thankful for my parents, my friends, my family, and my mentor for loving and supporting me through all of this. And I can't wait to graduate, woo! -hoo! I want to thank God family, friends, faculty, and everyone who made this possible. Muchas gracias. I want to thank my family, my husband Travis, John and Karen, River and Nico for being so supportive. Thank you mom and dad. Thank you Dr. Bob for being so patient with me and being so supportive. Thank you to my friends and Henry for taking care of me. Thank you friends and especially my family for the love and support that you've given me. I wouldn't have made it without you. I'd like to thank my parents, my family and friends for pushing me to finish my master's degree even when it was hard and I wanted to quit. I appreciate you. Thank you to all the professors and all the friends I made at ASU. Go Sun Devils. Thank you to my parents, to my mentors, teachers, friends, family, and Brady. You are all my rock. I could not have done this without you. Thank you to everyone who has helped me through my time at Arizona State University. I will miss you all. I'd like to give a special thanks to my wife, my daughter, and all my family for their love and support. I would like to thank my family, friends, colleagues, and professors for their constant support, knowledge, and wisdom that they shared with me. I would like to specifically thank my voice teacher, Dr. Stephanie Wang. I just want to thank my teachers, my friends, and most importantly, my family for always being a source of inspiration, motivation, and encouragement. We did it. We out. I'd love to thank God, my mom and dad for their hard work, my daughter Isabella, my baby mama Chantal, my supporters, and my mentors. Thank you to everyone who's supported me over the last four years. Thanks, mom and dad, for always supporting me. My family, my friends, and my professors, I sincerely thank you. This wouldn't have been possible without your support. I just want to thank my family again, my mom, my dad, and my sister. Thank you so much for supporting me through these past four years. Thanks to all my family and friends for a really quick but enlightening two years at Arizona State. It's definitely been a unique experience, but I wouldn't change it for the world. Thank you to my mother and grandmother that she's in here to help me to get my bachelor in IT media. Thank you. Thank you to my family, friends, brothers, the music learning and teaching faculty and the percussion studio for all of your support during my time at ASU. Thank you to all my family, my friends, and my mentors for helping me get passed through these four years in architecture school. Thank you to my parents, my family, my friends, especially to Alonzo and Jalen. You guys have really been there for me. I'd like to thank my family and friends for uh, being here every step of the way. I want to thank my friends and family that lifted up my spirits throughout these troubling times in these four years. I'd like to thank my family and everyone who supported me on this adventure of a lifetime. Thank you for helping me reach my potential and unlocking my destiny. Thank you, family and everyone who supported me on this journey. Go Sun Devils. Congratulations, ASU Herberger Institute class of 2021, the class that we will never forget. We cannot wait to see how you use all that you have gained with us to change lives, to build culture, and to contribute to our public happiness. The world needs your talents. So good luck, take care, and stay in touch. Well.